The last question that we have today uh, was the question that was asked with the most votes, and it's about marijuana. Oh, really? Stephen Harper style. Drugs are bad because they're illegal. It was the question with the most votes. Uh, tackled the subject of marijuana, and it, it is written as follows: a, a majority of Canadians, when polled, say they believe marijuana should be legal for adults, uh, just like tax, uh, just like alcohol. Why don't you end the war on drugs and focus on violent criminals? Well, it's a good question. I'm, I'm not sure I've seen this uh, particular poll. There, there are different polls on this subject that show different things, but. Um Stephen Harper style. I am this country's leader. They call me Minister Awesome. If one MP speaks out of turn, I'll straight up freaking toss him. I am one conservative dude, and everybody knows it. My tight D white D show it. I love the budget squeeze. Cutting. And yeah, you know, there's lots of crimes a lot worse than casual use of marijuana casual use of marijuana Stephen Harper style people defend uh, the use of, of drugs so this is something that we want to encourage drugs are bad because they're illegal I also want people to understand what we're really talking about here when we're talking about the drug trade Marijuana and pro-life don't get my attention span. Drugs are bad because they're illegal. And yeah, you know, there's lots of crimes a lot worse than, you know, casual use of marijuana. But when people are buying from the drug trade, they're not buying from their neighbor. Um, you know, I, I just wish people would understand that. Sometimes I'm frustrated by how little impact governments have been able to have on the drug trade internationally. Drugs are bad because they're illegal. Look at the violence it's creating in neighborhoods, the destruction of uh, social systems, of families, of governmental institutions, the corruption of uh, police forces. I mean, these are terrible, terrible organizations. Drugs are bad because they're illegal. Now, you know, I know some people say if you just legalized it, uh, you know, you'd get the money and, and, and all would be well. You look at Latin America, some of the countries to the south of us, and the damage the drug trade is doing. Sometimes I'm frustrated by how little impact governments have been able to have on the drug trade internationally. Speaker, the medical officers of health of uh, three provinces, British Columbia, Nova Scotia and Saskatchewan, as well as uh, perhaps one of Canada's leading public health experts, Dr. Evan Wood, have just written an article which states categorically that Canadian drug policy is going in absolutely the wrong direction. It's not based on evidence, it's not based on science, it's not based on reducing harm, it's not based on having a good effect. I'd like to ask why the Conservatives still don't have a good policy on addiction, don't have a good policy on mental health, and why they have a failed policy, and why they only have a jail policy, Mr. Right. Speaker.